The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is happening guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden Ultimate Freeze gift update for you guys. It is December 22nd, which is uh, Thursday, excuse me. I almost said Wednesday, but it is Thursday, which again means we do have new gifts in the game. There are four of them that were unveiled today. So what we're gonna do is like we've been doing throughout the week, we're gonna actually go in and take a look at what was in each one of the gifts. I'm also gonna give you guys kind of the percentages as far as how often these individual gifts were pulled, if you pulled a gift at all. Uh, today's gifts weren't particularly rare. There wasn't anything that stood out as far as being like something that we were super, super excited for, at least the majority of us anyway. And I think that you're gonna see that the gifts themselves Eh, they left a little bit to be desired. So let's take a look at them here, guys. The first three that we had today, the one on the far left there, uh, that one was going for five, or was an average of 5.05%, which meant that it was very common. The one in the middle, this one was one I think people were saying in previous years they used that exact graphic, and it was like a Bo Jackson. And then on the far right, I think most people knew this is going to be something to do with the flashbacks. So obviously here, guys, you're going to see that the first gift the one on the far left there was actually a George Iloka flashback card. Now, this one is extremely disappointing. First of all, it's an 86 overall. Like, bruh. 86 overall? That's barely better than a base elite. Barely better. Now, granted, George Iloka is like six foot four, so like this card does stand out a little bit from the pack, but still very disappointing. And not to mention, like, I don't know if EA messed this up somehow, but legit, this card does not have a card art on it right now. Like, how did we get here? I don't understand. The second one, then, was actually a North Pole uniform. Now, don't get me wrong, these ones might be kind of fun to use for, like, one day, but for the long-term value, like, these things are going to have no value at all. Like, these things are crap. This gift was obviously easy to pull. Um, so I'm, I'm really not too excited about that. And then obviously the last one was a flashback pack. Now, I know what you're thinking. Clickwit, we got a flashback player. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You forgot. The flashback packs in this year's game don't give you a flashback player. They give you like a bunch of gold players and then like a flashback collectible, which is worth like 3K. So there you go. Congratulations on your 3K on all of these gifts. I, like, I have no words for how crap all of these gifts are. And then there was one more. Now, this one could have been a saving grace on this whole day as far as, like, what was in the gifts. So, you see there on the screen, this one was the one that had uh, an average of 4.82% was pulled. So, it was still very, very common, but at least it looked like it had a lot of stuff in it. It looked like, you know, we might be getting some various different cool things. But, nope. Turns out it's just a Team of the Week pack. Now, the Team of the Week packs is by far the best gift of the bunch today because you can actually pull good stuff out of that pack. But overall, guys, these gifts are by far the worst that they've done so far in this promo. I'm very, very disappointed. Like, I, I can't imagine that anybody's excited about this. Seriously, like, I, I really can't imagine that anybody is excited about this. And if you had multiple of the uniforms or you had multiple of, of the George I Locas, like, it's almost going to be a chore for you to get rid of those because they're going to be worth almost nothing. I, I don't get it. I, I'm, I know they're saving good stuff for Christmas Day, Christmas Eve, and maybe even the days coming after Christmas. But this is still just complete garbage, man. Truly, truly, truly garbage. It's very disappointing. So I hope we're going to get better stuff here in the coming days. I'm still pretty confident at this point that we're going to be getting a Brett Favre of some sort. So that'll be nice. But... Overall, man, this this promo is pretty damn disappointing so far. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, though. If you did, please do me a favor, drop a like, and let me know in the comment section below, how are you guys feeling about this promo right now? Are you upset about it, or are you still really optimistic that we're going to get good stuff? Let me know in the comment section below. Be sure to drop a like, share this video, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll talk to you guys again soon.